channel, Lovey Subbies. How are you doing today? Today I have a special treat for you. Instead of just staying in the doll room and, well, in this part of the doll room and sharing a toy with you, I decided to share with you one of my doll collection, one of, one, a collection in my doll collection that I really, really love and I'm kind of sad, well, I am sad that it went away, but you know, I'm happy that I still have my dolls and I can share them with you. Hopefully you have these girls still in your collection. Um, so let's get over there to the other part of the doll room and I am going to show you this, these cute little girls. <laughs> So here we are, lovey subbies. I'm going to be sharing with you my Lottie Daw collection. You guys remember Lottie Daw from Spin Master? She came out a couple years back. And she is just a cute, super adorable little doll. And I happen to have gotten a few of these. I think there's a couple collections that I did not get. There's one... There's one of them where they were fairy tale characters, I believe. And then there was another one where they were like... Uh, insects like bees butterflies and i just never got around to getting them i got busy with you know adult life and all that booyah but anyway let me um let me turn this little light on here so maybe you guys could see them a little bit better there we go so on the top row is um actually this is the second collection that i got or was it the first one I can't remember, but the name of the dolls were Sweet Party, and they were get, having a party, and they're dressed up in costumes that represent some of their favorite candies. So over here we have Sloan. So there's the little um, little tag that came with her that was on the box, but I cut out and used so I couldn't wouldn't forget what collection she is. And it's Sloan as Lollipop Swirl, so she comes with a big giant candy lollipop. And then her dress has the same lollipop with swirls all around it. And her hair is super, super cute. And then she came with a box of chocolates. And then she also comes with a little activity book back there. They all come with an activity book that has, like, different things, fun little crafts you could do inside. And then next to Sloan is the main character in the Lottie Da um, world. It's D, and she's wearing. Let's see. Excuse me, Lee Bun. It says D as dots of style. So she's got a bunch of little candy dots all over her, and her hair is multicolored. And I love her big plastic bow. She's super, super adorable. And then she has like some candy dots on her face. These dolls are so cute, and I love that each doll came with her own stand, which is really, really nice, and the girls bend at the knees so you could sit them down, and they look super, super cute. Now, she came with this um, polka dot um, purse that she could carry, and then she also came with a hollow gift box right here. Let's see. So it doesn't have anything inside. It's just for show. And then next to D, we have Cyan, and I think she is in peppermint pose. And her outfit is really, really cute. So she has a little peppermint on the front of her dress. It's a plastic little bow, and she has the same bows in her hair. And her hair is like in these two super crimped pink and blonde ponytails, which is really, really adorable. I love her whole outfit. It's super, super cute. I think um, Cyan is my favorite in this collection. I just love how her outfit is really, really adorable. I love the colors that she has, and it all just goes together really, really super well. Now, next to her, this doll is super cute as well. It is um, Tylee as Cotton Candy Crush. So she's in a Cotton Candy-inspired dress. Her hair is Cotton Candy-inspired. She has, you guys can't see it because... You see that back there, her barrette? It's a giant cotton candy. Um, and I gotta say, I really, really love her too. I like the cotton candy glitter things underneath her bottom eyelid. Um, her lash line, I should say, not her eyelid. Um, and it's really, really cute. She's adorable. Um, I like her costume. I love cotton candy. But my favorite, I gotta say, is definitely Cyan. And then down here is Dee's dog, Libun. Libun. It took me forever to find this cute little dog. It's a little um, wiener dog. Uh, I don't know what happened. She came all by herself in a little package, just a tiny little package. 
And I think I got her at Toys R Us. I found her at some random Toys R Us. And I was like, yay, I finally found you. So down here is the second or the third collection that I got. It's called Runway Vacay. And each of the girls is taking a trip to one of her favorite parts or countries in the world. And these dolls are amazing again. So once again, we have Cyan here and she's going to... Oh, she's, it's called Viva La France, so she's going to France. Once again, Cyan is my ultimate favorite out of this collection. I love France. She's beautiful. I love the Eiffel Tower on her little hat. Her outfit is very, very adorable. Big bow in the back. Very nice, very Marie Antoinette inspired. Super, super cute. And then next to her... There's Tylee, who is called uh, Kabu Kabuki Cutie. She's going to Japan. She is another one of my favorite because, I mean, another favorite in this collection for me because I love Japan. And she's just super, super adorable and so stinking cute and gorgeous. And next up is Dee, who I also really, really love. She's going to um, India, and her name is Dee Bollywood Bright. And she's dressed up in a Bollywood outfit. And I love her pink long hair. It's gorgeous. And she's just a really, really nice doll. They did a good job with these dolls. They're amazing. And then there's Sloane, and she's called Safari Dreams. And she's headed to Africa. She looks amazing. Her hat is a zebra hat with a red mane on the top. I love the tribal painting on her face. It's gorgeous. These dolls, I even love them more than the Sweet Party dolls. They're just so great. And then they, each girl comes with an activity book. Again, she comes with her own doll stand. And each girl came with a suitcase, a rolling suitcase that actually opens. You really can't put anything in it. And the handles go up and down. Um, but it's really, really cool. I love how they were accessorized. And they also come with little craft books. So you could, like, design things. Because that's Dee's whole thing. And her girlfriends, they like to design stuff. So down here is the first Lottie Da D. It says introducing D, and she's called City Girl D. And she is so super stinking cute. I love this doll so much. She has the Statue of Liv a Statue of Liberty crown around one of her eyes, lids on top. See that? A gorgeous, gorgeous. And you could also change the style of her dress because she is a designer and then she has designer activities in there you could read about d she comes with sketches look at the cute sketches of her friends and they come in that cute little bag so you could carry them in so super cute comes with a doll stand all the way around gorgeous love her hair love love d she is amazing and then the last lottie doll that i purchased was i lovely bun and this is just d with some glasses um, I don't think there were any other girls in this collection. It was just D. Whoa, camera, calm down. There we go. And she just came with a dress with, like, Lee Bun on there. And she came with a book all about Lee Bun. And it was just basically about um, D and her love for her sweet little dog. All this happy cuteness. So that is my Lottie Dog collection down there. And then up top here... Oh, I hope this video isn't too long for you guys. Is uh, some uh, Lottie Dot dolls that I, you know, put together myself. They are Kabu uh, Kabuki Cutie Tylee and First Edition D and then a Bollywood Bright D. So what I did was I put them on Live Doll Bodies because I loved the Live Doll Bodies. I still do. They're amazing bodies. And I wanted to see what the Lottie Dolls would look like on bodies that look more proportionate to their head size because their heads are really big and their bodies are really small and thin. So that's what I did. And I just dressed them in a mismatch of, mix match, mismatch of clothing that I had. D's in a schoolgirl uniform. I think I got this from Takara Toys. And then uh, this other D, she is in a Live Doll outfit, super, super cute, and I did use acetone to get rid of her Bollywood 
um, bendy dot decoration in the middle of her forehead because I wanted her to look different, but I did love the pink hair. And then Tylee, I left her hair the same. Super, super cute. I don't know where I got this anime shirt from, but it looks really, really good on her and it's adorable. The skirt is a Barbie skirt. And then, of course, I put Monster High rolling shoes on her because I thought they were totally adorable. So there you guys go. That is my Lottie Daw collection. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, yeah, they're super cute, right guys? So I hope you guys enjoyed my Lottie Daw collection. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have Lottie Daws, if you miss them. Um, what do you love about them? They're super, super cute dolls, and I hope you guys enjoyed me doing something a little different today and showing you a part of a collection. Well, a collection and a part of my doll collection. <laughs> so there you guys go. Remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this Lottie doll world, you guys have a magical day, and I will be back here tomorrow for Wednesday's show. Bye-bye, guys.